Good afternoon LC people. Well the last bite went the other day. It's the calm before the storm tomorrow. There's another LC coming, it's a full rebuild. So look our cow, tidy the shed out. And as you do, you get involved with all other things. Steve Pellant asked me about this. That's all right, mate, I'll do it. Kev Scafield, I got this from him, bless him. Thanks, Kev. So yeah, I've sort of been doing the spanners. Bit of a bench there. I had that big bag on me compression. It was just squashing it. Still got that crap to sort out. But yeah, I feel a bit better about it, actually. I'm in a better place. So, okay. I've got this uh, LC shock. Worked fine. There was nothing wrong with it, so how it worked. But it was just shabby and shoddy. People are getting plated, don't they? But, you know, Dave goes old school, doesn't he? So I had to strip it. So the first thing is, is to actually get that part off of uh, here, off the shaft there. So what you have to do is you have to clamp the rod in something like aluminium in the vice, and basically that will twist off. Uh, it turns off anti-clockwise, turns on clockwise. And I managed to get out to bits, but I had to make some things to hold it, to do it, to strip it. It's been on the wire brush on the uh, on this little bit. There's not a lot left on that, is there? Most of it's on the floor. But hey, I'll use it till it's absolutely stuffed. That's what I do. <laughs> Squeeze the last ounce of it, guys. That's what you got to do. So, yeah, they were stripped, clean, degreased. Uh, they had some grey primer on them. Then they've had the silver on them. That's had a bit of a lick, lick of black. I've got the spring at the powder coaters. I've got to go and fetch it. I've got two power valve ones to do for my mate Roger that I borrowed off of him and I said I'll restore them for you. Uh, the damping works fine on this. It does on the other ones. They just look shabby. Um, so they've all had a lick of paint. They're just out here drying. But I'll give it a few days. I'll go to the powder coach and collect the springs. They've been there about three or four weeks. I just take to have the time to go and see them. But yeah, I've had an interesting day. Just actually swept up, which, uh, which is nice. It's the shame as all bits of war off these things. I keep getting them in my overalls and it bloody hurts. <laughs> so yeah, I've been putting more spanners on and bits and bobs and just faffing about really. But like I say, tomorrow there's a full rebuild coming. So uh, I wanted to be prepared for it. Uh, I think I've got to go order a battery for it. I think he said he hadn't got the battery. But hey, -oh, that's what it is. Anyway, folks, it's a lovely afternoon. The sun's out. And I thought, what better time to do a bit of painting? Temperature's good, sun's out. Everything gets baked. It's great. Anyway, folks, I'll keep you posted tomorrow when the new thing arrives. Who knows where the journey's going to go next. But anyway, folks, I've not forgot about you. Thanks for watching. And I hope you like my clock. Dilly dilly.